welcome to my channel. My name is Carrie and I am a product-based business coach, mentor, and strategist. So today we're gonna walk through a few examples of amazing packaging for subscription boxes or e-commerce businesses. Before we get started, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and tap that subscribe button below and leave a comment below if you love this episode. Product business packaging is so important. It's one of my favorite things to talk about and it's also wildly important for your business. Packaging creates an amazing customer experience. It makes the people feel good when they open your product and it's the first impression of your business. And when we're looking at customer acquisition, we wanna also know how can we retain customers? And so if they have a good experience with you the first time, then you're able to get them to buy again and posting on social media. So we wanna have great packaging for three reasons. One, we wanna create a great customer experience. Two, we want those customers to then refer friends and family or buy gifts for friends and family. If your product is something that they loved, they will also purchase for friends. And then number three, we want people to post on social media. So we want people to post on social media and then we want our products to stand out amongst the saturated niche that is e-commerce. So if you have great packaging, you're gonna stand out automatically. And so think of yourselves when you go shopping online or in a store, what products do you gravitate towards, right? Are you gonna choose the product that has the crappy label or the product that has a really pretty, fun, bright label that pops out at you? I'm gonna guess you're gonna go with option number two, but let's kind of go through a few examples of some great packaging for product businesses. I'm gonna go through two different products. The first is Be Mint In. Amazing box, just beautiful. Everything about this box is high end, high quality. So I absolutely love this box. I wanna talk about first the outside and what they did right. It's very simple and clean. Like they have a logo, they have like a dandelion flower, they have stuff on the side, they have stuff on this side. Absolutely love it. They're a business that really cares about sustainability and so I believe they use eco-friendly packaging if I'm not mistaken, which is why it is the craft and not like a white box. I think that's what they were going for. I also love this. There's a little sticker here that says, we know you're excited to see the goodies inside, but please flip us over before opening. I just think that's awesome. The third part, they put the label on the bottom. So I see so many businesses that put their printing label on the top of the box. That is not a good thing to do. You're ruining the customer experience. And again, when you get a package, why would you wanna cover that beautiful logo, right? That's your brand awareness. So let's open the box up and I'll show you on the inside. So here's the second thing that they did right. They have printing on the inside of the box. And so for me, this is like prime real estate. This is what will help you stand out on social media. You open the box and people are more likely to take a photo of a product that has something on the inside. The inside has their logo and it says a gift for your self care. And it says beautifully curated and ethically sourced. It has their logo, their social handles, etc. Absolutely love this so much. They absolutely nailed their packaging. This is one of the best packaging that I've ever seen. This is a company called Be Minton. They're amazing. They were actually a client of mine that I helped them start their business and I could not be more proud of them and just the amazingness that they're doing. So if you like products for self-care, so like foot scrubs, really high-end soap, things like that, check out their business. They have a lot of different boxes. They are perfect for gifts. They also are great for if you have clients, if you're like a business coach or anything like that, um, great for client. Be Minton, fantastic. Next up is my old box. So this was the old Dapper Dog box. So this is my company that I founded in 2016. This was my second box that I designed for the company. Again, the color has faded. This is like five years old. <laughs> when I sold the business, I kept one box for myself just as like a memory. The original color was more of like a lavender color, but I want you just to see the box because this was one of the proudest things that I really did for this business. I spent a lot of time designing it. Front part is the logo right here. So share a photo of your box for a chance to win a free box at the Dapper Dog Box. So again, I'm giving them a call to action. We want to always give our audience something to do, something that we want from them. So that's what I did there. I spent a lot of time designing this box. Three months, I spent researching to come up with the, the perfect design. So when I created this design, I was thinking in terms of people on social media. My audience are people, well, my audience was people that posted on Instagram. They wanted to showcase their box. They wanted to post pictures of their box with their dog. So I created a product for those people. We always have to know who is our audience and what will they like. The inside of the box here, again, all you need is love and a dog at the Dapper Dog Box. So we have branding, brand awareness, a fun slogan, 
logo. So in my opinion, this box design is pretty perfection. And I'm not just saying that as like a cocky thing. I spend a lot of time researching subscription box designs and I feel like there's so much missed opportunity. So many companies will have a blank box on the inside and it just doesn't look good. So when you're posting on social media or you're posting videos on Instagram stories or whatever, or even YouTube, and someone opens a box and it's like brown with nothing there, it feels, it feels boring. And again, the more you have something in here that looks good people will post on social media and then that's going to get other people to want to buy my sales pretty much skyrocketed after i launched this design okay that is that is a fact how i did this was when i first launched i used like a simple box company like box up right that was when i was getting really small quantities after a year i then decided that i wanted better boxes so i could have printing on the inside and so I found a box manufacturing company in California. I created my design. I worked with the graphic designer to put it together. And then I worked with the manufacturer to print my boxes. By doing that, you're committing to that design and that size of the box. I don't recommend that until you have some good volume, but it's a good place once you grow you want to have boxes that are scroll stopping. Last up, we have the CEO box. So again, this is another one of my students who was in my subscription box academy course. They actually have a bunch of businesses, but they then launched a business that they send gift boxes to coaches and, and you know, done for you services. So if you have clients and you need to send gifts to, they created a company just to do that. So they're absolutely amazing. And I have to say, I love the box so much. It's so pretty, it's simple, but it just looks so good. I believe now they have black boxes too. This is white on the inside, but what they did was they put a card up here. And so it kind of looks like that. I think it looks really good, but it's clean, it's simple. And they've also just launched, so they have time to grow their business over time and you know do more with the inside but i'll just give you a little sneak peek on the inside of the box so again it's going to be gifts for like ceos so this one has a ring light it has glasses it has oil it has like a chocolate it has soap it's it's a really really cute box but i just think they did such a good job with the packaging and kept it simple but kept it looking very classy these are three examples of great packaging for subscription or e-commerce boxes if you have any questions send me a dm on instagram i'll leave my note below and as always if you guys have not subscribed please drop a subscribe below and let me know if you have any questions drop a comment below i want to hear about your packaging how did you up with your design I want to hear more about your process of designing your subscription box let me know and i'll talk to you guys next week